right, guys. I'm just wondering here, right? I've got an idea. I don't want to talk to you about it, really. Um, currently out working. Saturday, sun's shining. Liverpool's playing a, a, in Wembley. Obviously, it doesn't really affect us that much. But people are still moving about here quite a lot. I was thinking, I was like, people say a lot, like, where's Uber's surge gone, right? Have they updated their algorithm, like, to make it go? But then, like, other cities surge and stuff like that. And Liverpool doesn't really surge that much now. I know people go, out of town drivers, Manchester drivers coming to Liverpool, blah, blah, blah. But we've always had that. And then you're thinking, um, are Uber's referral schemes currently on? 250 quid new driver. Yeah, but we've always had referral schemes. And we've always had the surge. The surge has really gone since COVID. Right? Now, myself personally, there's enough work to end all. So it's not like it's quiet. So it's not like there's too many drivers. Because I still pick up passengers on a daily basis saying, Jesus, I was waiting an hour for you and all that. So there's still... I wouldn't say there's a demand for drivers, but I wouldn't say we're, we're overrun with too many drivers, right? There's enough work. It's busy enough. Um, and that's obviously my personal opinion. Um, now, the only thing I can think of that's changed since covid and i think this is the reason why now before i say anything this is me not moaning or having a go every driver do what you want to do for your own family that's the end that's the way i look at things um so don't worry about it. i know loads of drivers who's doing it but the biggest change that i think has happened since covid has come is the local firms aren't bothered that you use uber as well as their firms um so as an example i know a good few drivers local drivers that drive for local firms that also have the uber app on and i'm talking all liverpool local firms um and most drivers that work on the local firm will have the uber app on now if they have the uber app on and just say over a 10 hour shift they only do five uber jobs because they're busy on the local firm but they've got that uber app turned on so the way sage works is it's it's demand simple as so you'd either have if, if there's more passengers requesting jobs than there is available drivers the price goes up it's sages yeah so if the if there's a demand too small or the too many drivers obviously it doesn't surge. but if there's more passenger requests then available drivers the price goes up right now this is my thinking on why the surge is gone because it's definitely not quiet out i'm doing all right today and working saturday and working sound but you just got that gray mist over the map it's not it's not surging um and i reckon just say you've got two thousand full-time drivers on uber in liverpool this is just a total guest number you know what I mean 2,000 drivers right um, and there's another 2,000 drivers driving for local firms but with the Uber app on so that's technically in Uber's algorithm computer generated surge algorithm Uber's looking at 4,000 drivers in Liverpool now half the drivers will be literally just having the app on picking being nosy, see what's popping off where, is it surging, and also cherry picking certain jobs, right? So as an example, one of the one of my mates who's not a taxi driver, he got an alpha the other week, and he said that um, he phoned me up after him and said, that's weird, the alpha driver, I heard the Uber chiming, chiming off, chiming off like yours does, and I went, oh, he was, he was working, obviously he's working both firms then, and he was like, yeah, but he never accepted any jobs. And the alpha driver said to him, he went, oh, no, I'll just leave it on. Even when he had a passenger in his car, I'll leave it on just in case a big job comes up, do you know what I mean? So he, he had a pass an alpha passenger in his car driving with the Uber app, pinging off, waiting for a job. Now, he's not going to accept one of those jobs while he's got a passenger, but he's still got the app on. So Uber still thinks that that driver is available for work. So, see what I mean? So even though it's busy, because all these additional drivers aren't accepting all the work, they've just got the apps open. In Uber's eyes, um, they're seeing 
uh, a huge amount of drivers and that's why it's not saving. That is my full process on it. I was just thinking about it the other day. I was talking to a few of the lads the other day and the major changes between COVID and after COVID and it's literally that. The local firms aren't bothered about you working multiple firms. That's the only thing you can think of because obviously if all those drivers that were working the local firms were accepting every job that they were got, they can't do that because they're working the local firms and they're busy enough on their own firm. Um, so that's why it's not quiet on Uber, but it's not surging. And there's a the difference. If it was quiet, then you know too many drivers, too many out of town drivers, blah, blah. Or it's quiet because there's not many passengers. Do you know what I mean? But the fact that it's busy but doesn't surge, that's where I come to my mathematical equation. I don't even know if it's true, it's just a guess. What do you reckon, guys? Does that sound feasible? Now obviously nothing's going to change, the local lads are still going to have the app on, cherry picking big works, that's fair play, that's up to them, that's sound, but I was just wondering, could that be the reason why um, the surgery disappeared? Who knows, no one will actually know the truth, but that's just my thought process on it. Now I know a few lads, personally, who work a local firm and Uber, and, and they do really well, they clean up, <laughs> so fair play to them. Myself, personally, I only work for Uber. Because I can't be bothered having like two phones or two apps and two systems. It just confuses me. And then I've got card work, cash work. It's all over the show. It's not my cup of tea. Um, but yeah, if you're doing it on the local firm in Uber, fair play, fill your boots. It's totally up to you, your choice. Doesn't Obviously, it's got nothing to do with me, what you do with your choices. You know what I mean? Um, but I do think that is the reason why. Let me know in the comments what you think. Um, am I onto something? Am I completely wrong? Have they just updated the algorithm to make it a bit more stricter so they don't surge as much? I don't know. I don't know. But at the moment, it's busy enough. This week has been the quietest week because it's half term. It's always quiet on half term. So uh, it has been the quietest week for a while. But hopefully that'll start picking back up again soon. When the kiddos are back in school, though. <laughs> but yeah, guys, hope you're keeping busy. Um, hope you're enjoying this lovely weather. It's actually picked up quite nice. It is 17 degrees. So yeah, that's it guys. I'm going to get back to work. Keep on grinding, boys and girls. And I'll catch you later. Peace out.